Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm super excited for this video because that means I'm going on my girl's trip. I have to pack. I don't know when this is gonna be posted, so I'm not gonna say where we're going for safety purposes, but if I post this after we've already been to these places, I'm going to Paris, Saint-Tropez, and Mykonos. I leave in two days and I actually already started packing a lot of stuff also in my closet room I have a rack of stuff that I've like been pulling and just putting on there in case I want to Try and make outfits out of it, but this older Dolce & Gabbana dress I think has to come with me. It's so European um, And then I also just want to like bring some basics like just like a little black skims dress stuff that requires zero thought because in here I've already picked out a ton of like outfits that I've snapped photos of. What I was doing before I picked up the camera was I was just going through a ton of boxes and stuff. My sister sent me this book she wants me to read so I'm going to take it with me. The universe has your back. I don't know. I'm having a coffee at like 8 p.m. but I have a ton of packages I want to open up. I got the Contacts T2, this is it. I got a package from Black Bow Swim. They sent me, I think they're in collection. How cute. And then this top and a triangle one. <gasps> Ooh, I love this. That's a cute design. But this type of top. Set Active is launching this collection soon. It's called their Montana collection. I actually just had Lindsay, who is the founder of Set, on my podcast, so I'll link it below. But these colors, I'm obsessed with this workout outfit. And then they also sent me like a little workout dress, which I feel like I have to bring with me. And then this is like one of my favorite colors of all time, this pink. And they also have it in like a little jumpsuit. And then also with the matching leggings. I love it. And then I also love their socks. I already have a pair, but I sent a couple others. And this massive ass mug thing. <laughs> this is heavenly. Especially because this is the only workout stuff I wear, pretty much. We just got to Paris. Okay, you walk in. Gorgeous. We're just here for a night and then we have an apartment for the rest of time. Missy. outside of the restaurant for three people at 6.30 tonight. At, at 6.30? Yes, please. Of course. Thank you. So we have I'm dinner tonight to in the hotel. Yeah, till the 13th. Till the 13th. Yeah, we made the res. We're going to do it. But we were just really tempted to no. not do it. So, I thought I'd voice over this part since I didn't really explain what was going on. But we were just getting ready for a little dinner at the hotel. I ended up wearing a very casual, comfortable look. And then we went to the restaurant downstairs. We stayed at Hotel Coast. It's amazing. It was like 6.30ish, but I needed coffee to fight my jet lag because I was exhausted at this point. And then I just show you guys a little bit of the hotel. It's gorgeous. I love it here. We got some starters, 10 out of 10. I got pasta and it was delicious. And that's just the table. 
And then we went for a little nighttime stroll. Really beautiful and it's really quiet. We went to Cafe de Flor and it was adorable. We sat outside. I show you a little bit of the food. And then we basically just shopped after this. What are you talking about, man? I'm talking about when he drops him and he almost lets him go into the What are you talking about? Into the center. You know that he puts him in the jar. He decides that he can't put him in the jar. He has to get him out of the jar. <laughs> we walked to dinner and passed the most beautiful scenery. Literally, it was stunning. I wore a corset and this vintage Pucci skirt. the most amazing day at the Monet Museum. It was, or not museum, his house, I guess. It was insanity. It was actually so cool to see in person too because you've seen all these paintings growing up and then to like be in person where all his inspo was from. Can't beat it. We're going to dinner now and I'm probably gonna film on my phone but I wanna show you what I'm wearing. I have some packages, so I thought I would show you guys some of the stuff I ordered or some of the stuff that was gifted to me, kind of show you how I'd style it. Two of the things I'm wearing came in my packages. Both are Princess Polly. I ordered that stuff. Does anybody remember when I did my capsule collection with them? I always think about that. I was like 18. And I just wish that if any brand wants to do a capsule with me, please, because I would come up with such great stuff now, but my style then was like just so weird. And then I also wanna show you guys all the stuff I bought in Paris when I went vintage shopping and in Saint-Tropez um, because I got some crazy good stuff and amazing finds. And so I wanna show you guys them because obviously I love fashion and all things revolving around it. 
and probably most of you guys do too if you watch my videos. Who is screaming outside of my window? It's really hard to maintain health when you're traveling so much in my opinion, but now that I'm home, I'm back to it. Got some groceries. I squeezed some fresh celery juice in my juicer this morning. Last night I made these like coconut crusted turmeric chicken tenders. Who wants to hear a really interesting fact that I just learned? This woman who is an expert with all things gut and gut health was talking about different healthy regimens and things you can do and foods you can eat. She said that a teaspoon of turmeric powder like every single day is equivalent to 30 to 60 minutes of working out. Obviously, I don't think that's like calorie wise, you're not burning calories if you take turmeric, but I think it has something to do with inflammation. But she did say that, so I'm just the messenger. I actually just discovered recently how to use my frother on my coffee machine and now I'm just never going back to any other ways. Well, I'll use this cute flower mug because I kind of feel like it goes with my vibes today. I don't know why. We're gonna do a double shot of espresso. Wanna see something cool? Tap my coffee machine twice, then it does two shots. Where's the lens? What's going on? Something is being funky with this camera. Okay, one, two. See, now it's two shots, play. And it's gonna give me two shots of espresso. I think. Okay, well, that definitely wasn't two shots. Hmm. Well, if anybody knows what that actually means, I guess let me know. Never mind, I was right. It's gonna start, I swear. It's gonna go. Oh. Some might say this is too much cinnamon. Some would like to mix their cinnamon, but I am obsessed with the taste of cinnamon. I remember when the cinnamon challenge came out, besides the part where you like choke to death on the cinnamon, easy. This is everything you're gonna need for avocado toast. This is key. I also have been doing turkey bacon, really love. I'm gonna do it on half a bagel. You'll see the final product. It may not look great to you, but it's literally one of my favorite meals, foods, breakfast. I, I think I've had this variation of avocado toast for three years straight every morning without fail. Hey guys, it's been a little bit. I'm back, hi. I wanna show you guys what I got. To start out, I came home to this little, oh cute. I didn't even notice that, a matcha lemonade. That sounds amazing. Oh, stop. Look how cute she is. Hold on, if I can even get it. Stunning. I literally have a little coffee shop in my living room, cute. So this is what I got when I got home. Set Active sent me some stuff. I'm obsessed with these little jumpsuits. They fit really well and also they're really easy for working out. They sent it to me in black. And then I also had it in like a navy blue, which I worked out in yesterday, so it's in the laundry now. And I also have it in light pink. As I mentioned earlier, I got a few things from Princess Polly. I'm wearing two of them. This is just a very simple white t-shirt because I buy stuff that I already have. I haven't tried this yet, but I wanted like a long white skirt that I could just do with like a little sweater and sneakers. I got this shirt because I like the Flintstones. I'm not sure if this place sent me this stuff or if I ordered it. I don't know where it's from either. I think it's at a source unknown. Got these blue pants that are really dope. These might also be from there. These white linen pants. I'll just link it below because I'm not sure what this company is. Little mini skirt. Oh, I thought this top concept was kind of cute. So they sent, or I bought, I literally have no idea. It's a little strapless top and then it has just like you put this over your head and then it has sleeves. I got these green cargo loose pants, which I really like. Socks from Princess Polly, I guess. I got these cute bows from Princess Polly as well. 
They remind me of when I'm young, but I thought it'd be cute in my head. It will be. Frankie sent me their collab with Wildflower. Love Carlson sisters, love Francesca. Very cute. The bottoms. Another one. Cute. Bottoms to that as well, obviously. It's her little catalog. Slay. Also came with this cute little beach bag. I like this one, it says Malibu. And I really like this pattern. Thank you, girls. And also from Frankie's is this blue dress, which I'm not really sure how this works. I'll figure it out. Then this company called LMA sent me some stuff. I love these little heels. This color combo of the yellow and green, there's a lot going on there. But I love these, they're so cute. I think that the pointed toe is making a huge comeback. Also, I love a kitten heel because they're way easier to walk in than an actual heel. This bag is beautiful. It's like a little wicker and brown situation. Sorry I keep looking at myself. It's just to make sure I'm in focus. I'm not trying to be a narcissist by constantly staring at myself in the screen. But if it's blurry, I won't post it because I get so upset if it's blurry. Then I got this sweater also from LMA. It's like this really soft kind of material. I don't know how to explain it. I love it. It's very preppy to me and it's very charming and cute. And now before my dog gets home, we have to put all of this away. And I also want to show you guys everything I bought in Paris, but I'm going to show you from like a different perspective. I'll just like go in my closet and show you what I got because I don't know where half of it is. I got these sunglasses at a vintage store in Paris as well. That's the brand. That's what they look like on fashion. I got these Gucci slides at a store in Saint-Tropez. This necklace is so insane. It's all these like amazing black stones. It's from, I think she said the 60s. And it's just such a statement piece. I got my sister and I these matching rings. I got my mom her birthday present when I was there. Mom, this is your warning. I'm about to show you a birthday present. If you happen to be watching this, please quit out, please. It's like the most beautiful necklace I've ever seen in my entire life. So that's that. Just a big cross. And I think she'll love it. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll talk in my next one.